What's going on guys, Austin Nurcho here and today we're unboxing the Star Wars Smugglers Bounty Funko Box. So we're doing this one again, the theme is indoor, so as you could see it had Wicket there on the top which I'm super excited about because the indoor stuff is one of my favorite parts from the um, Return of the Jedi. So I'm excited to see what we got and let's see from the start from what I kind of expected is what I it was expected, but we'll leave that for the last. Um, so first off it looks like we have some socks here, that's kind of cool. So we have some Funko socks, I don't know if we've gotten socks before from them, we probably haven't, I just don't remember. But let's see what it is. Okay, so it's the indoor skyline. So as you can see here, so we have like the trees and stuff down here at the bottom. Then we have the satellite dish, of course, that um, is projecting the, um, whatever you call it, uh, shield around the um, it's Death Star, which is up there in the sky, the half-built Death Star there. And then, so yeah, that just looks really cool. It's just the um, indoor skyline. And next up here, I don't know exactly what this is, but it's a little can, it says Star Wars Funko on the top. Then we have indoor scenes, so we have a little wicket there. Then we have an ATST, and then it looks like some Ewok Village going on there and stuff. Um, yeah, and there's a little Death Star there in the background. So I don't know what this is. I assume there's something in it. So let's see. We got. Oh, it must be like a mystery mini or something. I like this container though. So let's see. What did we get? Oh my gosh. It's a little stuffed animal. It's a little pocket keychain. I've seen these things before. I don't know what they're called. Um, doesn't really sound there because I've seen them advertised that they're doing it. But we got a little wicket. Um, keychain, so like it's a pop figure type thing that they turned into a keychain. Like I said, I know that's a new thing they've been doing, um, but I really, uh, I think it's cool. I mean, I don't like keychains or anything, but I really like this and super glad I got Wicked because it's one of my favorite characters and stuff I buy figures of and everything. So that's really cool that we got that. Then next up in here, we have a patch for the month and it says indoor on it right there and it has Wicked on the front and then I like all the trees and stuff going on there and the little logo. So that's kind of cool. And so our pop for the month, which again is what I was sort expecting it is the scout trooper on a speeder bike so i was expecting this because i'm like well, what can they do i doubt they do wicked and stuff and they already did a three pack of the ewok so i'm like i don't really understand what else could be but i was like i wonder if they do a scout trooper on a bike because they've done the luke and the or the leia with the chase version of luke which i still can't find anywhere um but yeah they did the scout trooper on the speeder bike so again this is just like the leia and luke one but this time it's the scout trooper so here it is out of the packages and you can see it fully now. So we have the speeder bike here. Of course, it looks like all the speeder bikes, every speeder bike that they make. And a toy type thing looks almost exactly the same. So there's nothing new or special going on with it there. Then we have the Scout Trooper, which of course we have just a normal Scout Trooper pop already. So now it's a ride one. So where it's attached to the bike but still has the bobblehead. It does kind of turn the wrong way, but I can't get fixed really. And then of course it's on the base so it can like help hold in stuff. And it looks like the ground of indoor. It says Star Wars right there. And we have the invisible pegs to make it look like it's floating and everything. So it's very simple and plain, but I love these. I love the pop rides. I wish I wasn't like so anal about the stuff and you know, want to keep them in the boxes and everything because I think they really look really good out of the box and I just want to take them all out and set them up and display them and stuff but and I like it but I can't do that for any reason but I really like that so that is really cool and I'm glad that we got that. So that's going to be it for the indoor box and I hope you enjoyed this. I really did between the speeder bike and then um, this container that I think is really cool. I don't know why, you know, it's just a container, but I really like it with the design and everything. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, let me know in the comments down below and don't forget to subscribe to see more unboxings and we'll see you next time.